I'm Rani Pinchuk from uh, Space Application Services, um, Knowledge Management Team Leader. Um, in the Knowledge Management Team, we are looking into semantic technologies, semantic models, and uh, natural language uh, processing techniques, and we try to mix those two. For example, we did question answering over semantic models in the past. Um, in the project, we also look into those things. We um, are the main partner that uh, implement the space science demonstrator in the project. So preservation, uh, long-term data preservation for, for us is very important because we are working with a space um, um, industry. And um, Space science, so, so data is, that is collected from space usually is data that is collected... Um, uh, first of all, it is many times very, very expensive data. So to send uh, payloads to the space is very, very expensive. Um, secondly, uh, in many cases, this is data that we observe things. So if we observe the sun, for example, we observe the earth, we cannot observe tomorrow what we uh, what we have seen yesterday. So we cannot replicate the data. Um, this is also very um, interesting because there are a lot of challenges with regard to that. Um, if we collect the data as a bunch of numbers, we have to be able to understand it um, also after 50 years because especially data that is observed is very relevant for the future. So to understand the um, for example, changes in climate and so on. Um, and there is big difficulties to understand just numbers. We have to augment the numbers with a, with a meaning of the numbers and also with the way the numbers were collected. Uh, and there are very, very complex issues with regard to how the um, experiment um, sensors were calibrated and so on. If we don't collect this information carefully, uh, the numbers will not be useful for future scientists. They will not trust those numbers. So this is the reason we, f we find the project uh, important and interesting. In, uh, in Pericles, um, what is uh, interesting for us, what we found interesting in the first year was the um, integration of uh, or our target to integrate three different things. We are looking into semantic models, so to uh, model the different um, data concepts and so on and the relations between them in such a way that it is understood uh, by those that access the data. Um, on the other hand, we are interested to, to see how the data um, and different um, software and whatever, hardware, is dependent on each other. So, for example, you cannot understand calibrated data fully if you don't understand how it was created. If you don't have, for example, a MATLAB version that ran the calibration script. Um, so, you have to create a dependency graph between all the things that are dependent on each other. Um, and it will be very nice for us to integrate those two. So, the dependency graph and the semantic model. And adding to this, we also want to look into policies that govern the way um, the, the data is uh, modeled and um, govern also the, the way we look at the dependencies. And if we can integrate into this also the policies, it will be very nice. So this is uh, something that we try to do in the first year.